In fact, this new machine is the missing link between the CNC and the conventional lathe. I am here with Vasil to talk about the brand new LS600M from ZMM Bulgaria. So, Vasil, what can you tell me about this new machine? In fact, this new machine is the missing link between the CNC and the conventional lathe. Uh, this is the machine that we have developed based on our experience throughout the years and having the feedback from our customers uh, all this time. And of course, having uh, the luck today of, um, let's say, of um, skilled workers, of skilled operators, and yes, just to meet the customer needs. And I just want to get across to the audience that this is the very first machine to leave your factory. Is that right? Yes, you're, you're right. So this is the first machine that comes after the engineering sample. Still, the engineering sample stays in our factory because it's a machine that uh, needs, to, needs to meet every customer requirements and our engineers are working on it according to customer requirements to improve the software, to add some additional features that the customer might need afterwards. Now, on this machine, you can run it in full CNC mode and full manual mode. So what are some of the benefits of being able to have a machine with both options? Usually customers are using the CNC machines for mass production at the moment. And uh, nowadays conventional and universal lathes are being used for maintenance, for servicing, for some repairs and uh, such things. So this machine is capable of uh, covering both needs. In fact, uh, the customer should look on this machine not only as a machine itself as a cost, but also as a combination between the machine and the operator. Yes, it's a little bit uh, uh, higher class machine, but you don't need so skilled operator on that machine, which is very hard to find nowadays. And talking about this machine not needing a higher skilled engineer to run it, can you talk me through the control? Because there's some features on this control that means anybody who can read an engineering drawing can actually run this machine. Uh, yes, exactly. You can see uh, here. Maybe let's first uh, have a little uh, have some words about uh, the conventional um, mode of this machine, because uh, unlike the CNC machines, uh, here you have also the feel of a conventional lathe. Uh, you have the tactile rotary switches. That you have everything that a conventional machine gives to you. On the other hand, so you see that. Uh, it works as a conventional machine with a digital readout right now. And as a CNC machine or in the automatic mode, you can see all the elements that are input prior to the programming of uh, this machine. And on each element, when you choose one element, you just choose the measurement. So you just need to know how to read a diagram, how to read a drawing and input directly the elements. So with everything you said, this machine just seems so easy to run. If I can read an engineering drawing, I can run this machine. And also, having the best of both worlds where I can do a complete production run on this machine, or I can run it in manual mode to do them little tasks that to program on a full CNC would take me far too much time. So to me, this machine is a very well-rounded machine and should be something every machine shop considers. Yes, I also think so. Uh, as you mentioned, you need quite a lot of time to program on a CNC machine with all the G-codes. And here, for example, we have, a, you know, we have a part that you can program just in five minutes with uh, some presets here. So, in fact, this machine has uh, two types of automated mode. The, one uh, the first type is just simple, uh, simple uh, machining, like cone, cylinders, threads. In fact, thread and thread repairing is a very common usage of such type of machine. So we have added not only thread, but also a thread repair um, as a feature on this machine. The second uh, type of the automated mode is having a cycle with additional elements. So you can add up to 14 elements in each cycle and have such complex shape that you can make in one run. And this complex shapes, it just takes just five minutes to program. So just to finish off, you can take a part that to program in G-code would take you at least an hour and program it in five minutes just because of the presets on the machine. And then also be able to run this in manual mode as well 
to do the little odd jobs a CNC machine would take you far too much time to program. Exactly, maybe not uh, just half an hour or an hour, or at least you would also need a year to learn G-code prior to that.